So guys, the other day I was in my local Walmart as I do a lot, just snooping through the fishing tackle. Come on, you guys do it too. Your wives are there getting groceries or something. And you're like, oh, I'm going to go for a walk. And you're over there just checking out, wait, what kind of clearance stuff they might have in the fishing section. And I noticed a rebel teeny wee crawfish. Then I happened to look about six inches above this and saw this from Arky. Hmm. Two dollars and thirty-six cents. Four dollars and eighty-three cents. And looking at them, they're almost identical. Same size. They just call one Fire Tiger and one Chartreuse Brown. And the Arky is like a slightly glossier finish to the matte finish on the Rebel. And yes, they're both made in China. You're looking at this Rebel here that costs over twice as much as this Arky. There's the Arky. There is the Rebel. Five centimeters for the Arky. Same exact size on the Rebel. The lip is even the same size and molded almost identically the same. They both have split rings, but the Rebel actually says Rebel on it. Same size hooks, but I'll be honest with you, uh, the Arky actually has a heavier duty feeling hook. I'm looking at the general mold of the two. They're almost identical, except the one thing I do notice on here uh, where the claws are, the Rebel, like you see on all theirs, is actually cut all the way through there. I guess it's also going to give you a little bit different action, uh, probably aerate some bubbles behind it a little bit more, whereas the Arky has just kind of got some indentations on it. But again, other than that slight hole on it, they're, I can't really see a difference except for the glossy finish and slightly heavier duty hooks on this Arky, which again is less than half of this Rebel. So how do they work? We got them both out on the Water Wolf underwater camera, tested them out, and yes, they both run, I would have to say identically. Uh, both the more shallow running, uh, really, really super tight wobble. And here you go, we're even going to show you the, the, the slow motion of each of them. They're, again, they're pretty much identical lures, except one has a glossy finish and one has a matte finish. And one has that hole all the way through between the claws, the other's got the indentation, and then the hooks. And one says Rebel, and one doesn't. They're both made in China. Uh, they're pretty much the same exact stinking lure. So if I was going to my local Walmart and I saw both of these on the shelves and I had to pick one over the other, which one would I choose? If I really didn't care about the really shiny finish on it, it's a no-brainer. Yeah, somebody might not want the really shiny finish on it. Aside from that, the colors are pretty much identical, except the Arky has more of a dark, dark green on the top as opposed to a little bit more brownish. But they're both like orange faded up into the top darker color. They're both basically a fire tiger color. Same size. Same action. Same performance. But again, twice as much money. You're paying for Rebel. And they're both made overseas in China. So you can be like me. You can buy two of these Arky Craws for the price of the one Rebel. Snag one and lose it, and you still got money left over. So guys, if you haven't yet, go down below, give us that thumbs up, subscribe to the Fish Yacker YouTube channel, share this video all over the place, let us know what you think, and if you have ideas for videos, let us know too, post those down below. And if you want to go fishing with me, post down below and give me a holler. Catch you on the water, guys.
Fishyacker.com. The original kayak rigging video series.